Ladies and gentlemen, KJ here, and I'm back with another episode of NBA 2K13. Well, it is time for our first divisional matchup of the year, ladies and gentlemen, and it is one of the bigger ones. It is Bulls versus Cavaliers. We are in the midst of a back-to-back. -back. We won our first game against Philadelphia, 63-59, as you can see. And now we are looking to complete this back-to-back -back by facing off against Cleveland. As you can see right above that, we had already one back-to-back. -back. It's very weird to have these, in my opinion, especially for a 29-game schedule. You would think that they would schedule it so you had, like, no back-to-backs. But we have surprisingly a lot of them. Okay, it's it's weird. It's weird. Um, but we did not fare very well against a good OKC t team in a back-to-back. We're hoping to do better against Cleveland here. Now, although they do not have Kevin Love or LeBron James, they do still have Kyrie Irving, which could cause us some difficulties and some problems. He's always an amazing scorer, can make plays out of nowhere that no one else can, very much like Derrick Rose in that sense. So it's going to be a good matchup between him and Rose. I don't know if I'm going to control Rose as much as I usually do, just because I don't know if I trust myself on the defensive side of that. Might go to Mayo. I like to deal with a point guard or a guard of some type rather than be worried about the in the paint stuff and all everything. Let's go ahead and get this game started. See if we can continue the success that we had from last game. In that game we, we started off good. You know, we built up a twelve point lead. Um Got, got going fast, really pounded it at them. But the 76ers came back, tied it up in the fourth quarter, and I was actually getting very concerned and worried. We were able to pull away by about five points, get the victory by about between four and six points. Um, dude, I just went over. It was just four points, 63, 59. <laughs> I, got, I got a great memory. So we're hoping for a little bit better luck this time than that time um hopefully get a lead and be able to keep the lead and not just let it fall completely apart down the stretch here are the starting lineups Kyrie Irving Eric Bledsoe Sean Marion Jan Belzy and Expan Odu Odin Odon I, I, I'm bad with last names it's a continuous trend if someone knows how to pronounce that, um, give me like a sound it out. T tell me it like I'm in grade school. Help me sound it out. Is it O U? What is it? I, I have no idea. Well, he's going to be trying to gain this tip off with splitter there at center court. He will actually win the tip. And we are underway with the Cavaliers having the ball. Bledsoe gives it to that Odin guy. Oh man, already getting offensive rebounds. Dudes, that is not the way you want to start off this game, okay? Do you really want to start it off by letting them get offensive rebounds? Oh, Derrick Rose though. Dangerous as always. Fadeaway shot gets it to go. That was an amazing one. Irving off the mark from three-point range. Didn't really have much defense on him. I was kind of helping Mayo double coverage, dude, so. Prince open. Doesn't get to go. Gibson hauls down the offensive board himself this time and gets the second chance bucket with a huge rim-rattling dunk. He had a couple big offensive boards last game, but they were not being converted to points. A couple of the times I thought they might have been fouls, but no calls, so it's good to see him gain back on track and gain things going in this one. Rose to Mayo. 
There Gross from long range won't go, but Gibson hauling it down again. Ooh. Rose left open. That's a dangerous move. That's a dangerous move. I think Mayo was kind of helping out there a little bit with a little bit of a screen there. Got two guys up on him, which freed me up to take the shot. Now Marion with it, backing down Prince. Looking for somewhere to go, has nowhere, and he misses it. Had to shoot up at the last second, and it does not go. Mayo kind of sidesteps over. Splitter with the offensive board. Puts it back up with the left-handed hook. That's like, what, three, four offensive boards now? I think that's like three or four offensive boards by the Bulls so far in this game. Those are some crazy, outrageous numbers. And I am all good with getting them. Irving comes running in. Good play there by him. Able to find a hole through the defense up the lane and gets the layup. Reach in call there, and that's a good thing. Really didn't have anything going. <laughs> Time was running down and we didn't have much going on. So now, some substitutions will be made by Chicago. Anderson, Akels, and Birdman all come in. We might have to go to the bench today due to playing back to back game here. Akel has to force up a shot. Time was running down. Does not go for the rookie. Birdman hauls in the rebound off the miss. It might have been Marion. I don't. Couldn't get a good look. Derrick Rose! Oh my god, he just destroyed that rim. Dude, I want to dunk intensity on that one. He pulled the rim halfway down. Why don't we get the dunk intensity for, like, everyone? Or at least the ones that are, like, most important. Because that one. That one looked. That one just looked vicious. Brian Anderson. Probably hit it from there. I don't wanna. If I don't have to. Oh, that's... <laughs> that would be a, a very poor choice. Reaching call again. This time on Irving. Give us 14 more seconds on the shot clock then. And some more substitutions. Looks like Peterson and Lucas are coming in. As well as Heinrich. Gives it to Heinrich. Goes flying in. Misses, but he gets his own rebound. John Lucas the third for three. And you can count that one. Nice assist by Heinrich. Now Babbitt with it. Gives it to Constantine. Misses. Offensive board. Gets it up and in. And there's a foul on Peterson. So he will go to the line to shoot one. Gibson comes back in now. For... Was that Akeels? I think it was Akeels. Gets it to go. And it's a two-point game. Time running out of the first quarter here. I'm not going to direct traffic. We should be able to get two possessions out of this. Stops, pops, and gets it to go inside the paint. Nice job by Kirk. Now... 
Cavaliers looking to make something happen here. Goes up. Wild shot. And a wild foul. That's the second one on Peterson. Back to back down the court. The rookie. Got to learn to keep your feet on the ground. And not go jumping wildly flailing your arms. Because that is basically what he did right there. He just went. Aah! And once again. You guys would probably benefit from a webcam. Because I just was like flailing my arms and everything right now as I was doing this so you you the 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 benefit is a lost when you can't actually see it you know <laughs> uh, <laughs> makes I believe both of them yeah he made no he made one of them or did he make both I don't even really remember what the score was but we get the last shot of the quarter here Heinrich, oh, nice spin move there by Kirk. Gibson gets the offensive board and puts it back up and in. Kirk missing with the original shot, but Gibson right there to clean up on the glass. Grabs it, puts it back up, and it will go. Bulls up at the end of one 17-12, five-point lead as we end the first quarter. Nothing to complain about there, guys. If you got a lead going... Into the end of a quarter. Cannot complain. Um, offense offense was not bad. I think it was, what, probably mid-50s, I'd say, shooting. Low to mid-50s, I'd say, shooting. Um, I felt the defense did a pretty decent job. Offensive rebounds. I think we got like four or five in that quarter alone with Gibson and um, Birdman and Splitter. They have just been pounding the glass recently. And I am loving it. Okay, I cannot complain when they do that. I've been complaining a little bit that they haven't been grabbing the defensive ones, but the offensive ones, they've been grabbing them and putting them right back up and in. So, great job by them. Wow, he really came out for Ryan Anderson there, didn't he? They're afraid of our three ball. Instead, they should be... Ooh. You know, I was going to say they should be afraid of Captain Kirk doing that kind of thing, but then he missed, so. That was only a two ball. It looked like it could have been a three. I'm surprised it wasn't. But Rose will bring it back up. Oh, Rose. Oh, what was that? What was that, Rose? He just kept running right out of bounds. I swear I was pulling back. I was pulling back on that stick. Irving was just all over him and riding him right out of bounds. Oh my god, that was that was that was horrible. Shoots, misses, and Ryan Anderson pulls down the rebound. Kirk Flying in there, gets the bucket and a foul on Constantine. He will go to the line to shoot one. As major changes for both teams, all five for them, all four for us. Kind of don't like it when the game does this kind of thing and just does a massive substitution of everyone. Next foul, they'll be subbing them right back in, so it's kind of like, what are you doing, man? Completes the three-point play. It's good to see Kirk gain some points. Good to see Kirk being aggressive, driving to the hoop, and gain those buckets. Don't see that enough from him right now. Oh, wow! We were all going up to get that thing, but little did we know. We had someone flying in to put it right back down. Damn, I don't know who that was, but that was a thing of beauty. Bellinelli shooting from long range, missing. Lucas tipping. I think Cavs touched it. Oh. I was going to say Cavs touched it last. Lucas got a hand on it, but I thought one of the guys in white touched it after that. I guess not. See, look, they're all getting ready to check back in again. What the heck? Oh. I lost my man. 
I lost my man. I can't let that happen. I'm too worried about the people on the sidelines. Ooh, nice job by Lucas. Hitting up the rookie, Peterson, who's spinning dunk there. Puts it down with authority. I don't... That's amazing. I didn't think the rookie could do that. On the other side, an easy layup once again. Who the heck is that guy? He just burned me a second time. I'm not getting back and focusing on defense. <laughs> like me personally, I'm just not. <laughs> I'm too busy commentating, man. I can't do all this stuff. Guys, do you, do you want me to play the game or do you want me to commentate the game? Come on, you gotta have priorities. Some stats, but these might be changing because people might be coming in here. Uh, Lucas with three points and an assist. Mayo with an assist. Uh, rebound for Prince. Gibson, four points, four rebounds. And two points, one rebound for Tygo Splitter. Splitter, of course, last game had a huge one. Recorded a double-double, 11 points, 11 rebounds. And many of those rebounds were actually offensive rebounds. I believe two or three of them were. Oh, that's a reaching call there on Henson. Tell that one was coming. Okay, ref, give me the ball. It's time to continue the game. Oh, and another reach in. This time on Constantine's. His second, third of the team. Alright, if we're going to keep doing that, fine. I'm cool with that. Oh. John Lucas finds Mayo underneath the basket and puts it up and in at 16 points in the paint for us 14 for them got to get the easy ones sometimes the easy ones Irving has the ball as he's back in here turn around jump Marion gets the rebound goes back up and gets it to go Prince trying to stop him but not enough not against Marion, man. Sean Marion knows what he's doing around the basket. OJ Mayo for three. Oh, wow. Th that, that net didn't even move. Did you see that? I didn't even know it went in because there was like no movement whatsoever. Prince hauls down a hard fought rebound. Finally gives it to Lucas in the front court. Prince. Oh, wow. Kind of hop stepped over, and I was pressing the X. It wasn't responding, and I pressed it last ditch effort, and he got it to go. Prince can just shoot that buzzer beater it doesn't even matter to him he's just like yeah I've got this don't worry about it. and boom with that Cavaliers are forced to take another timeout as we look at the stats they have changed dramatically since last time Lucas got another assist Mayo five points now in that period of time Prince two points two rebounds guys starting to come alive here at the end of the second half just a little bit less than two minutes in the first half with the Bulls up by seven. Cavaliers are inbounding it. Constantine with it. I'm trying to guard him. This may turn out poorly. But I'd rather guard him and have him score than Irving. I'd rather get burned by Constantine than Irving. Oh, wow, as Irving just got blocked. 
by the Secretary of Defense, Taj Gibson. Gibson was just like, nah, man. You aren't doing that in my house. And then, on the other end of things, just puts up a nice jumper right by about the free throw line. Ooh. Bulls operating at full efficiency right now. Irving, though, that's a good, that was a good play. Lucas and Gibson were trying to stop him that time, but he just powered it right over us. Prince with it. Okay, I need someone to help here. Splitter. Gives it back to Prince, takes a three, and it will go. Tayshawn Prince with his first three of the game. Irving now with it. Ten point game. Oh, wow, that screen is just killer. That screen, that's the back to back times that screen has killed us. Back to back times that screen has killed us. Oh, Prince wide open, but he miffs. And there's a loose ball foul on Gibson. That'll be his first team's first. Cavaliers will keep the ball with pretty much one possession left in this game. Or just, just half. Sorry. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself. Tayshaun Prince was left wide open that last possession, though he couldn't make it go. Oh, Rose tips it, and it goes out of bounds. Oh, it goes out of bounds off his foot! Off the foot! Rose tips it, but then the Cavaliers player must have kicked it, like, at the last second. And so the Bulls will get the last possession of the half. Rose circling in, puts it up, and it drops. 1.6 seconds left, no time. And that will be halftime, ladies and gentlemen. Strange occurrence there. At the end of the half, Rose tips the ball up, and then it bounces off a Cavalier's foot, giving us the last possession and allowing us to go up by 10 points right now. Bowl shooting 64% from the field, 55 for the Cavaliers. So both teams playing very well. The offense is, seems to be clicking for both of them. Just seems that the Cavaliers are a little bit off right now. I don't, I don't know why. I mean, I don't think our defense is playing that exceptionally well. Not saying it's bad. It's about average, I'd say. But I mean, I think the Cavaliers just aren't taking taking advantage of all the opportunities they have right now against us and if they were to it would be a much closer game that being said I hope they don't start taking advantage of that because I kind of want to win <laughs> but I'm, I'm pretty happy with our game so far I think our offense is playing very well and gain a lot of offensive rebounds I cannot complain against that even on the defensive side, we're getting some decent rebounding. Looks like they're full courting us already here. We're only starting the second half and they're already starting to full court press us. It's going to be annoying. Mayo almost lost it. Gives it to Prince. Last second shot this time won't go. Ooh, Prince. Prince tried. He tried. He tried to interfere with Marion's shot that time. Get get off me. Get get off me. Spin around and get off me, man. Dude, if you don't get off me, I'm gonna spin by you and drop it right in the bucket. Come on! Learn how to play basketball, man. Where are you throwing it to? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Where was he throwing it to? 
Oh my god, Irving, where were you throwing that ball? There was no one there! There was absolutely no one there for you to catch that ball. I don't know what you were doing. OJ Mayo gets blocked on the other end. Irving now, a lot of pressure by Rose, but he still makes it. Tibbs calls a timeout, and that's a good thing, because I'm still dying over that pass. I want everyone to just pause the video, go back and look at that right now. I, I really, really want you to do that, because I don't know where he was going to. You know what that should be on? That should be on... I should start it, man. Shacking the Fool for video games. Dude, that would be on Shacking the Fool for video games, okay? LU pass! Whoop! Right to the Bulls player. Because literally, Tayshaun Prince was the only player in that area. That that would definitely be on Shaq and the Fool. Definitely. Oh man, that 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 made my night watching that. Gibson wild shot. They're defending us really hard right now. You know how I said that, you know, we were getting some good shots and hoped that they didn't change their game plan. Well, um, they've changed their game plan. Oh, wow, Gibson blocked it. Big block by Gibson, but Irving gets it back and shoots the three. I don't know what you can do about that. Cleveland coming back here in the second. We are just... Kind of stagnant right now. Can't get anything going. Look at us. They are all over me no matter where I go. Come on. Get the... F Ooh. They're still running. S stop running. Oh my god. They pulled down the board too. Second chance. Won't go. A splitter hauls down the rebound. Rose brings it up court. Oh man, that was crazy. Prince kind of buys a little bit of separation, like like a millisecond of separation, and then just launches it. He's just like, "All right, I'm a little clear. Go." Their defense, they have stepped it up right now, man. All the guys are, like, getting worn out from this. Here are some stats for the starters, though. Derrick Rose, 10 points. Mayo with 5, 0 and 1, 7, 3, and 0 for Prince. Gibson, 6, 4, and 0, 2, 2, and 1 for Splitter. I don't think he's going to do a repeat of that double-double. But the Cavaliers have really upped the intensity. They've come out with, like, a lot of, like, motor right now. Like, they, like, jacked themselves up with some energy drinks or something back there. And they're, like, buzzing around the court. Like, they are, like, running at us on the offense. And then the defense are just all over us. Like, seriously, they, like, must have had, like, a... Oh, my God! Oh, my God! He did it again! Irving did it again! Oh my god, he did it again. Not once, but twice. Kyrie Irving giving the alley-oop to the mysterious man. And thanks to that, Prince finds enough daylight to drop a three, bringing the score back up to a ten-point lead for the Bulls. Irving, dude, you, you, gotta, you gotta start planning your alley-oops better with your guys. Because this is, this is, this is getting very embarrassing. Although that wasn't embarrassing. That was, that was beautiful. That was absolutely beautiful. Oh, Derrick Rose! Derrick Rose! You can't stop him! You can't stop him! You can't stop him when he's got a hole that big! There's, there was no one in the paint! He drove right in there! When he encountered a little bit of resistance, it wasn't enough! 
got to play better transition defense than that. If you're going to full court press, make sure you stop them in the backcourt. Otherwise, you're screwed. Good defense on the air. And then by Rose. Now allowing Irving to get a good shot up. Gibson with the rebound. And the Bulls go back to work. Mayo steps back, hits it. Oh, wow. When things are clicking like that, and you can hit the step back one footer. Oh, man. This, oh, wow. Wow, Irving. He deserves those points. I'm not, even, I'm not even mad. He deserved those. He deserved like three or four points for that one. Man, beautiful screen, beautiful spin, beautiful find in the paint. Oh, but there is Derrick Rose with a beautiful find in the paint of his own. Taj Gibson hammering it down off the assist by Derrick Rose. Whoa, I was a little scared there. I've seen those kind of passes go into the bleachers twice here, so I was a little, I was a little scared. Rose brings up court. We could go two for one. Oh, Mayo nearly lost it. Mayo nearly lost it. Find Splitter, who pops it up and in. Off a hook shot there. Cavaliers will get the last shot of the quarter. You know, we could have if we wanted to. But I didn't want to. Man, these, these screens. These screens. Gets fouled by Rose. That was me. That was me. I'm okay with that, though. I'm okay with that. That was, that was a good foul. I'll take that foul. Make him go to the line and shoot the free throws. Earn the points, man. Earn the points. Although it is Irving, so there's a good chance he's going to make these. Oh, he misses the first one. Look at what I did. I did that. I don't know how, but I, I'm going to take credit for it. We're making a massive substitution here as all of our guys are worn the hell out. Gets the second one to go. So. Oh, Heinrich! He lost the ball! He lost the ball, Heinrich! Dude, you can't lose the ball like that. Uh, I don't know what you were doing there, Kirk, but it's okay. It's okay. At the end of three, Bulls are up by 11 over the Cavaliers. 51-40. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling, I'm feeling good, you know. We, we had a good game last game, even though we nearly lost it in the fourth quarter. I swear, if, if, we, if we almost lose this thing here in the fourth quarter, we're just horrible. <laughs> but back-to-back -back good games... Especially after that that debacle that we had against OKC. It's really, really improving my confidence, getting me going. I'm feeling good now. I'm feeling good. Let's finish this thing up strong here. Start of the fourth quarter. Let's do it. Let's do it. Kind of like Gatorade, man. Oh, crap. No one's on him. <laughs> I just noticed that. Oh man, our defense switches are all messed up. Bledsoe, I believe that was. Oh man, they've, they're really pressing us. Gives it to Tayshaun Prince. He's doubled. Bellinelli goes, doesn't get it. Birdman with the rebound, won't get it. He gets knocked down in the process. I don't know how that's not a foul if he's on the ground, but whatever. Okay. Layup is good for Odin. Odin. Whatever you call him. Wow. Okay, come on. Get off me. Maynard gets it up into the front court.
Anderson with it. Won't go. Nope. Nope. I knew that immediately that it wouldn't go. Bulls bench right now. Uh, we might like crack under this onslaught of them. Cause Cleveland is like keeping this up, man. Seriously, what is in the Gatorade on the sidelines for them? What did they spike that shit with? <laughs> They're like running on like NOS right now, man. Good Prince. I gotta take Prince out. He's not doing good right now. We'll put the rookie in. He had a he had a decent game a couple games ago. Against Oklahoma City. In the loss he had like ten points. He's got nothing going right now. Well no one does actually. Heinrich's the only one who has points right now out there. Oh man, this is gonna get ugly fast. We're up by five. It was one time eleven. We they've scored six unanswered. This is bad. This is so bad. We need something here, guys. We can't just kind of slide through here. Bellinelli, wide open. Oh my god, it rims out. You're that open, Bellinelli. You can't miss it. Bellinelli now trying to guard Bledsoe. Oh, Irving gets the layup. It's three points. We need something here, man. Can't get anything going. Kirk launches it, missing it. No one's even crashing the boards, guys. Crash the boards! You've been doing so good with that. Why are you stopping it now? Oh no! Tibbs, we might need a timeout. We might need something here. Oh my god, we had 11 points. They have scored 10 unanswered right now as Heinrich gets fouled there. I'm sure that's a foul. If it is not, then I don't know what the game of basketball is. 12 unanswered points by Cleveland. Tibbs, you better be putting all the stars back in. Do I have to do it myself? Okay, fine. I will do it myself. Okay, I can't put Prince in. He's still not good to go. There, we'll go with that matchup. We need something right now, because the bench is not doing it. And right now we have lost the lead. We, 12 unanswered. I seriously didn't think that this would happen. I, I, I don't... I'm speechless. I'm just kind of... I'm speechless. There are no words to describe what has happened right now. We went from up by 11 to down by 1. No offense whatsoever. Rose takes the shot and gets it to go. Finally stops the bleeding. Oh my god, finally, someone competent in there that I can trust, that I can rely on to take the shot. Oh. Oh, come on! How is that not a foul? He pushed my guy down. He pushed my guy down. Ryan Anderson got mugged there. He got thrown right to the ground, and they're not even calling that. Oh yeah, drill the three, Anderson. You you don't want to call a foul on him? Fine, he'll just drill the three on you. Screw you. I almost swore there. <laughs> I almost swore, but I remembered it. I'm just we're trying to go for a PG show here, man. But when there's muggings and illegal activities going on, it's hard to do that. Splitter backing down. Oh, they're calling him a... Really? They're calling that a charge? Oh, it was Marion. Yeah, okay. I can understand that. Marion likes to get those kind of calls, if you know what I mean. 
How is that a charge? But but Ryan Anderson getting thrown to the ground is not a foul. How? How is backing someone down a legal move in basketball, a charge, but throwing Ryan Anderson down to the ground with a forearm, which is basically a wrestling move, not a foul? Please, please enlighten me. Hell, if it was in hockey, the guy would be going to the penalty box. Man, what the hell? Oh, the one time that they do an alley-oop and it actually works. You know, third time's the charm, I guess, and it's at the expense of the Bulls here. It's a tie game with one and a half minutes left. It should not be a tie game. Considering what we were up by. Oh, come on! Yes, that's a shooting foul! He fouled him when I was shooting! He fouled him as I was shooting! That is three there, buddy! Dude, that is three! <laughs> oh my god, this, this game has not made me laugh so much in a long time. Oh my god, Mayo. Mayo, you... Mayo. Please, Mayo, don't do this to me. Gets one. Alright. Third one coming up here. At least, at least get two. At least make it a positive trip. Alright, alright. I can, I can, I can work with that. I would have liked all of them, but, you know, I'll work with what I can get right now. Irving with it. Shooting, missing, and Ryan Anderson pulls it down. Gives it to Rose, bringing it up court. A minute left. Bulls up by two. Splitter with the... Ooh, Derek Rose driving in. Splitter with the beautiful screen. Allowing Rose to get around the defenders and get in for the layup. Double clutching layup, I might add. Irving spins. Rose on him. Shooting. Gets to go. Can't do much about that. Mayo. Brings it into the front court. Thought about taking it all the way, but he won't. Ryan Anderson, dude, you gotta finish that. You gotta finish that. You gotta finish that one, man. You gotta finish that one. Last shot is theirs. They could tie it and go to overtime if they want. Puts it up and it will go. Tibbs takes a timeout. 3.3 seconds left. If we score, we win. If not, we're going to overtime. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> These are the moments, man. You know who's going to take it. You know who's got to take it. It's got to be Derrick Rose. It's just got to be Derrick Rose. This is going to be so hard for him to get that shot, though. They're bringing in Tayshawn Prince, too, which is good. He should probably be in there anyway. Okay, okay, okay. Rose Hanks misses off the rim. We are going to overtime. So the Cavaliers come to life in the fourth quarter, go on a 12 to nothing run, and get this thing tied up at the end of the game. 60 all. We're going into overtime. Um, I've really got no words. You know, we had a good game until the fourth quarter when we completely broke down. I mean, overtime was the death of us. The bench did nothing for us. We win the tip-off, though, so we got that going for us. Oh, don't, don't step out of bounds, Rose. Don't step out of bounds. Give it to Gibson. Gibson dunks it down. Gibson dunks it down. Off the dish by Rose. Ooh. Like it. I like it. I like it. 
Let's let's get some stops now. Let's get some stops. Let's get some stops. Bledsoe with it shooting offline, but they get an offensive board. Misses again. It's Prince hauls it down. All right, all right. Let's let's take our time. Get something going here. Gives it to Mayo. Looking for somewhere to go. Kick out to Rose. Fakes. Spins. Irving with him though. That was that was good defense. I'll I'll give Irving that. That was amazing defense they had right there. Shoots, misses. There's an over the back foul, and that is on Firstly, I think that was against Prince as Prince ended up on the floor. Bulls will have it. 152 left. Bulls leading in overtime. 62-60 right now. Derrick Rose with it. Oh, looking for Gibson again, but the pass was not there that time. And Bledsoe glides in and gets the layup. I... I don't know how we let him do that. That was just horrible transition defense. Rose glides in, gets the bucket. Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. Irving with it, misses, but a follow through by Odin, or Odin, or however the hell you pronounce his name. Tied back up again. 110 left to go now. Mayo from three, offline, but Gibson gets the rebound. Mayo has it now, will reset. Drives in and gets the layup. O.J. Mayo. Redemption there after that missed three. And that's some sweet redemption. Oh, reach and call on Rose, I think, there. I'm not even controlling Rose, and that happened. Uh, okay. Okay, let's, let's, let's be smart about this, guys. Come on, let's, let's not commit too many penalties here. Oh, blood so easy layup. Easy layup. Rose now brings it up. I would really like to go two for one here. Spins around Mayo. Wow, gets just blocked. Blocks from behind. Derek Rose. I don't want to be on this big man. Why the hell am I on this big man? Okay, you take over the big man role. Oh my god, breakdown on the defense! What are you guys doing? They, they put me on, on the center. Or the power forward. Why do you do that? They put Derrick Rose on the power forward. Why are you doing that? I have no idea why you would do that. Why would you do something as stupid as that? Derrick Rose with the ball now. Puts it up, but he gets fouled in the process by Irving. Gets fouled by, by Irving, and these are the two biggest free throws that I'm going to make right now. Oh my god. I'm scared to make these free throws. I'm so scared right now. Made the first one. Okay. Oh god, my heart is like thumping like crazy right now. Gets both of them. Alright. Timeout Cleveland. They will get one chance here to win it. Or we go to double overtime. Oh. Why? <laughs> why? I don't want it. I really don't want it. Oh, 
god, who do I want to play as though? Cause I don't, I don't want to play as any of these guys, man. Irving for three, missing. All right, double overtime. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, we're going to double overtime. Both of us only scored eight points in that overtime session. Oh my god, this is crazy. This is insane. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> this is this is not safe for anyone's health. We did not get it this time. As the Cavaliers come up with it, Irving with it. Oh wow, good defense right now. Rose trying to get that ball away from almost tipped it there. Finally, they get the basket. I. There's just no words for that. That's just too good right there. Oh my god, Prince got rejected. And now they're on the run, Marion. I think that's the game right there. I think that's the game right there. We 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 were going tit for tat the first overtime and right now yeah, right now they're ahead, so this is not good. I don't think we got enough energy or stamina or anything left in the tank to do this. Makes both free throws. They're up by four. I don't think we got it in us, man. I really don't right now. Oh no, Mayo, you turn it over! Oh yes, this is good. How is that not five seconds? How is that not five seconds? Do, do we have to count one Mississippi? Two Mississippi? How many Mississippis before it's five mi seconds? I have no idea how we've lost this game. Gibson puts it up, gets fouled on the way, but he is not a good free throw shooter. And in this situation, I'm not confident about this. Nope, not gonna go in. Nope. Nope, nope, that was a bad release on my part. Son of a... Gets the second one, though. Three-point game. One and a half minutes to go in this game. How is that a reach-in? That's Rose's fourth. That's Rose's fourth. If Rose fouls out, we're done. Okay. We could be done anyway, but if Rose, especially if Rose fouls out, we're done. Irving, floater, good. It's a five point game. Mayo for three. Oh. That's it, guys. That's the game. We were up by 11 going into the fourth. Oh, my God. This, this hurts. This, this just hurts. I can't do anything. I, I, son of a bitch! How do you go for a steal? Like seriously, I don't know how you go for a steal properly. Every time I try and go for a steal, I get called for a reach in.
So, so please, if someone could tell me in the comments how you do a steal correctly, I would be very much appreciated. I can't do anything. If Rose does anything, it's... Well, the game's over anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Out of bounds. A little bit too little too late, though, guys. And Tibbs knows it too. Bench comes in. Just chuck it now, man. Heinrich for three. Still won't go. Okay. So the Bulls will lose. Final score 76 69 in a double overtime. How the hell it even got to double overtime, I don't know. We. We had an 11 point lead going into the fourth quarter and I said as we were going in that I was feeling good and that we shouldn't be able to blow this but the Bulls are an amazing team in that they can find a way to throw away any lead that they have check out the real Bulls for example they throw away huge ass leads all the time so this is nothing new or different Kyrie Irving, player of the game. Oh my god. This one just hurts. This hurts. I mean, OKC, we didn't really play good during the whole thing. I mean, the whole thing, we were just playing horribly. Like, we... We just played bad the whole game. But this game... We had control throughout the whole thing. And then the fourth quarter... I don't even know what the hell happened. Oh. I, I, I truly don't know what happened. Fourth quarter, we just, we were just bad. Look at that. 27%, they shot 83%, we shot 27. They scored 20 points, we only scored 9. How did we do that? How do you just... Just tank? Look at this. 17. 19. 15. 9? Look at their scores. 12. 14. 14. 20? What the hell? What the hell happened? I mean, I know it was a back-to-back. -back. I know it was down the stretch and we were tired. But really? Really? Okay, let's exit this game here. This, this one is just bad. It's just bad. There's no excuse to lose that game. There's no excuse to go get only 9 points, be outscored by 11 in a quarter. There's no excuse for that. Especially when you're leading by 11 going into that quarter and you, you, you get outplayed like that. That's... That's just... That's just sickening. I mean, Irving jumps way up the leaderboards now to get into the All Star game. Rose is at the top, surprisingly. I have no idea how. But I mean, that was just embarrassing. We've dropped so far down the rankings right now. Look at this. We're not even at home court, man. We won't even get a home court. We're, we're six? In the conference, we're six? When are we in the division? We're tied with Milwaukee. We've still got two more games to play over them, but still. Oh, man. That was, that was just... That's just sickening, in my opinion. 
Um, that's not going to be one that I forget. That's, that's one's even worse than the OKC one. Um, that's where I'm going to leave it, because otherwise I'm just going to keep rambling, and this is already a very long episode. Um, if you enjoyed the episode, please go ahead and leave a like. As well as any comments you may have down below. Otherwise, I'm KJ, and I guess I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.